Hey, what's up? This is Justin with wingsound.com. In this video, you'll learn how to create a master fader, automate some tricks with your filtering plugins, your gates, and even put some compression on that. Let's check it out. Okay, so I have a track here and I want to add some master fader techniques such as compression and fading out and all that kind of stuff. So to create a master fader, shift command N for new track. And then when it shows up, you know, from the drop down menu, choose master fader mono stereo depending on what you're working with and then create i've already created one as you can see right there and it defaults to volume automation so let's start with that we'll do a fade out so let's just say i'll pick a part on the track grab my pencil tool i want to fade out from here to here i made two points as you can see right there get your grab a tool drag those points down and you created a simple fade out, very easy. So what a lot of people like to do is put some filtering on it. So I've, I've instantiated the air filter plugin. So I'm gonna choose a preset, uh, let's see. phasing pulse let's just say okay and what i want to do is basically automate bypass on and off so to do that you know turn your plugin automation open the window and then choose whatever parameter it is that you want to automate master bypass so that's what i'm going to do okay close out this plugin and then go to your master fader the automation drop down window and as you can see, the air filter gate, master bypass. So when it's all the way down, it basically means that it's on. So that it's not bypassed. So I want to bypass it over here. Just in the beginning of the track. So I'll just make that one point and the rest of the track is going to be normal. So let's just hear this now. So you get some really cool stuff, add more dynamic to your track with that. So next thing I want to show you is another effect. Let's just say you want to just automate one of the parameters. So I want to automate just the format of this. I've chosen a preset on this talk box, the air talk box that comes with Pro Tools 8. Again, open up your automation. So I want the format, choose OK. Let me close out the plugin. And then again, go down here to the automation, the talk box and the format. So grab your pencil tool and let's just say towards the end of the track, I want to do some craziness. So I'm just going to grab the random and then start over here and then just draw in a bunch of random stuff going on. So now let's take a listen to that. Okay, you get the idea. You can really spice up your tracks. And of course, what a lot of people do is they put compressors on their master fader. So here's my compressor. I've adjusted some of my parameters to get what I want you know basically you put a compressor on so it makes the overall mix sound very cohesive and you could really control your volume and your levels and stuff with that so I just put the compressor on now it's here with the compressor and I'll bypass it so you can hear the difference <laughs> You can always get in touch with Justin at wingsound.com and check out more of Justin's videos including these titles featuring the new Pro Tools 8 now available on demand at wingsound.com.